Good day, guys. It's me, Ozzy Aiden, and today I'll be teaching you the best OBS settings for recording at 60 FPS. So let's just get on with it. So first, what you need to do is download OBS Studio. You silly. What are you gonna do? Change the Windows Movie Maker settings? No. -o. So once you do that, downloaded it. You um do this, and you'll be seeing this bullshit. So to change this. You need to go and scene um on the scenes tab thingy, press plus and name whatever scene you want. I'm gonna call it scene one because it's only made. Then on sources, um do the plus icon again, go on display capture, add a new one, and make sure you're selecting your um monitor. Then press OK. As you can see, I didn't and then oh my god, it's disabled. You right click it and press enable preview and bam. So what you gotta do now is go in settings. And I like to keep mine dark because I'm emo. And um, comment down below if you want me to do some stream settings because yeah. Go on output then recording. Put the output mode to advance and change the type to standard. Change your recording path to whatever you want. And don't bother ticking this because it's absolute horse shit because it doesn't really do anything. The reason why I can't do anything is because I'm recording with OBS so I can't do anything. Okay. Change the recording format to MP4 because that's the greatest. And change the audio track to, to we are number one. Change the encoder to H and you know the H one. The H neck thing. Um, take rescale output and change it to 1920 by 1080 because yeah. Then you go onto the audio tab and change everything to the highest bit rate. But I can't because I'm recording. Then you go into your audio and change the sample rate to 14 hertz. But I can't because I'm recording. You mess it up. Then to record the like the audio, um, like f like the gameplay audio. Go on desktop audio device and change that to your speakers or headphones. If you wear your headphones all the time, do that. But if you sort of, yeah. Then if you, I don't recommend this, but if you're live streaming, do, do your microphone here, but since I don't want to, do like, use Audacity to record your audio voice because, yeah. Then you go on to video and change these two. To 1920 by 1080. I can't change it because I'm recording. Then on downscale filter, you change this one. So change the common values to 60 FPS. I can't because I'm recording. On hotkeys, you need to primarily focus on the stop and start recording. I like to keep it at um little dash at the corner of your um keyboard because that's easy to find when you're lost. So I change those two buttons because how he's supposed to record when you're recording again. Then on the process priority, change that to above normal because you want it to be above normal. On the U Y U V color range, change that to full and change the U color space to 709. I'm pretty sure though that's the setting. So that is the best settings. For recording at OBS, any game, browser, and all. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, don't forget to turn the like button and throw the comments. And thank you so much for 180, 180 subscribers. Ooh, from the gaming guru.